thank you Brahman for explaining my um, means purpose of the speech and how you are going to evaluate uh, along with that I would request you all that uh, I'm going to might going to present this uh, speech in division contest contest for B division B so I will be presenting this so I would request all of you to give me feedback no um, while giving feedback no need to mention your name but uh, that uh, means no need to be polite and <laughs> of course you all are but uh, uh, whatever honest feedback yeah I need to be improved and I have to go far my time should start now <laughs> I am restarting your time. <laughs> <laughs> what a prayer of Caesar teaches us. Be positive. How many of you agree with this line? Everybody, right? And now, how many of us want to be HIV positive? But my friends and guests, do you know that everybody of us has HIV virus in our body? But problem will be there when it turns positive. When it start controlling your immune system. So same thing happen with our ego. Everybody of us has ego, but it will create problem when you start controlling you. My friends, this ego stops us from asking for help, making mistakes, forgive and say sorry. On the other words, I want to say it makes us stubborn, lonely, insane, insane and foolish. So, if I have ego and you have ego and we all have problems, you agree on that. So why not? If this ego is such a dirty thing, fear of Jesus. I'm really sorry that Jesus I missed. If that I have that wonderful tool. That is pair of scissors. Let me cut this ego from us. So when you cut your ego, it will turn to love. And if you cut your ego, then world will say, I love you. I want you all to say, I, I love, love you. you. So, that pair of scissors taught me this lesson. So now come to the second lesson. I have this trick. Do you know that? How many English words, characters, this trip represents? Only I. Right? Only I. And how many letters we can form out of this I? Not even single, that is only I. And that I represent I. Till now, who is not responsible for, who is not helpful, not useful for anybody else but myself. So let me use this wonderful tool of pair of scissors to cut this into two. So tell me, with this two strips, how many letters we can form? We can form T, X, J, just verify it. All those five letters. Now, let me do it one more time. Let me break it one more time. Let me use this. And now, those are three. Streets. So with those three streets, how many letters you can form? So you can form some more letters 
and the least is bigger one. So my friends, this experiment can be done so on and so forth. But have you noticed that? Whenever I break this trip into one more piece, its utilization getting increased. The same happens with our life. The same happens with our lives. Whenever life breaks us, so our utilization getting increased. My friends, if you have that thought in your mind, and when your life breaks you, then don't worry. I think that life might want to write winner out of you by breaking you into pieces. So my friend, they keep that attitude with you because broken means grown. And if you have that in your mindset, then whenever your life breaks you, then I'm sure you will say, break me baby one more time. <laughs> <laughs> because broken means grown. That was the second lesson. I have one more wonderful thing with me. This is wonderful string, which contains beads of different colors and single red color string holding it. <coughs> I think this represents our community because this contains different colors, <coughs> black, white, brown, male, female, rich, poor, all the categories, all the diversities, but still our community is beautiful because it held by, it bound by single bond that is bond of humanity, bond of red color, universal brotherhood. That bond keeps us together and makes this community beautiful. So my friends, that pair of scissors taught me simple thing. Whenever in your life, you are broken, then break your ego, but do not break the bond, because that bond keeps us together. Cut your ego, do not cut the bonds. That is my lesson, that pair of scissors taught me. Thank you very much.